Right guys, so we're down here at Parkwood International. Look at this. Look at the entrance here into the 10th hole. Look at this gateway. Doesn't it just? This is very like nice. Very It's like a graveyard, Jamie. So we're, <laughs> we're 100 uh, metres from this little par 3. I'm down here with Jamie Turner. Yes. Go for it. Oh, it might be a bit Come big. On, back in, cut back in. Sit. Hold on, hold on. Oh, it's just zoomed off the back, unfortunately. I think you're leading of the day, though, so far. And also, we're down here with Ben Tulipan. There you go, sir. Who, uh... He's playing, playing well. Value for money, they call it. Now you hit that well. Is it long enough? Yeah, yep, good just good on. Shot, good shot, good shot. Lovely and clean. Still not quite decided whether I'm a, I'm a pro or an amateur today, Jamie. Oh, I, I do believe you are a pro, just but you've allowed time. yourself to come down to our standards. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna just knock this one in, so that's it. Bring me back, bring me back up to game. Oh, this is magnificent! I'll tell you. Oh, just passed. Just passed. Flew the flag. I bet it actually looks closer on camera. Let me zoom in and show. <laughs> I reckon this looks closer on camera. So, yeah, it's not bad. Yeah, you're right behind. Ben's the flag. just there. Jamie, you just snuck over the back, sir. It's not long. It's not up and on long. <laughs> right, Ben. So found just on the corner of the green. Uphill. Uphill, slightly to the left. Well, we want to see this drop. We want to see this go in. That'd be a two-shot penalty with a flag in still. Don't worry. We can edit the flag out. Yeah, nice putt. Not quite hard enough there. Go on, Jamie. Knock it on. Chip it in. Oh, what a beautiful shot. He's bringing his A game today, isn't he? It's all happening. Hey, what a shot. Um, you can have yours, Jamie, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see Ben's in still. So I think he can, I think he can hold it. We're going first? Yeah. Too easy, Rick. I roll her in. I'll get in. Ooh. Ooh. Only at the last, it fell away then. It's a little bit slower. It's a little bit woollier. Well deserved and honest par. Go on, Ben. People may think we're picking on him by making him put it out. No. We don't think so. No. No, I think it's fair. Uh, putts in this one. Oh. I love his confidence over those short ones. <laughs> no messing about. No messing about. Right, we're going to head up. Right, guys, so we moved over here to the 12th, par 4, with a drivable brook, which I've just been laughed out, laughed at, because apparently you call it what, Jamie? Creek. A creek. The Aussie slang. A creek, so <laughs> a brook is way too fancy for us. Okay, I think I, I think I'd knock it in the brook. <laughs> slash creek. I can't even do it. Creek. Uh, when you're at it, go on in the creek, give it a rip. He's cut him a tad. I've cut it a bit. You know what? I'm beyond the trees again. I'm gonna go for it. You'll do it. I'm gonna go for it. I've been took. I've been persuaded into hitting Ben's driver. I don't feel like mine's going as straight as it should be. <laughs> Which is surprising with the smoothness and sweetness of your swing. You're having a laugh. If in doubt, use a different club. Right, I'm gonna go for it. Over the brook.
I tell you, go, go hard. Is this it? Well, hopefully I've hit it that bad it stops short. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the club, funny enough, it's me. Just coming out a little too early today. There we go. Look at that. There we go. You, you got the... Yeah, Benny. Yeah. A bit lower. Lower what launch is what loft is that? 9.5. And you've had it lower? Yeah. That's 8 degrees. Because I play on my back. <sighs> that is still went relatively high. Yeah. Yeah, I'm I'm at like 12 degrees when I hit. Right, superstar. Leader so far. And probably uncatchable by this point. I'm trying to I'm trying to rank up the pressure here, Ben, on him. I don't think Jamie's phased. I don't think he's bothered about this. No, he's got a feed of the fat. He's going to go o over the brook. Yeah, give it a rip over the brook. It sounds so strange when you say it, Ben. <laughs> it's just not right, is it? Just not right, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> and he's going for it. Oh, that's ripped. Like my arms, just a tad short. So do you have a... Do you have a, a bad miss considering that you have no shoulder joints? What, what's your, what, do you have any issues within your golf game that could be leading to that or not really? Uh, possibly, yeah. Um, I've got to allow myself to believe my arms can follow through. I tend to choke it a lot because uh, if I get to a certain point, it, the bones pinch with the upper arm and the, and the, uh, coll and the um, collarbone, they pinch underneath the skin. And if I, I receive one of those during a game, I tend to pull short and drag my arms in and cut the ball a lot. Right. It's, uh, for me, more so psychological than it is physical. Yeah. No, I can imagine. I but, really could. Uh, 46 years of age. I've, this has been my life. Um, well, you've always been, you've, you've known no different. I've, I've never known no different. I can thank my father. If he hadn't have uh, dead set, ripped the cotton wool away and just made me face life, I probably would have been something a lot different. Yeah, no, it's good. Very so, good, very impressed, you. very impressed. And we were talking, Ben, before about what, sh what do you feel like your limitations are in your swing? Yeah, mine's mainly my weight transfer. No weight transfer. So it's you were uh, talking before how, because your left leg yeah. is more prosthetic than your right, That's you struggle right. with the, so the if, weight transfer. If, if I was a left-handed golfer, I can transfer my weight quite easily over. But being right-handed, it doesn't transfer. If I go too far this way, there's no return. I tip over like a tower. You're gone. So, yeah, it's uh, the weight transfer is a little, little hard. And you might have seen that in some of the shots where Ben's just obviously just staying more onto his right side because of that's how it is. Tend to play off the back foot, which creates a lot higher ball. And you, I guess then you get, well, kind of both, both players, you've, you're very much reliable on your arms, aren't you? Yep. You know, to hit. You've got to try and, are you yourself yeah. the same? Yeah, um, I'm probably more lucky than Ben. I can rely on a bit of uh, transfer and rotation of the stomach area. But, um, yeah, I guess when you, you, you deal with disabilities, you do whatever you can with whatever you have, the best of your ability. And yep. one thing I think Ben and I have found is that when we come across ample golfers like yourself, it kind of gets them a little disturbed how, hey, Ben can hit a ball or I yeah, can Yeah, exactly. Ball. I'll tell you what, I, I've been... Well, first off, I knew what your handicaps were, so I, I knew that you were going to be a good standard, but very impressed the way you played in tough conditions today because it's not been a nice day. You've kind of shown me up a little bit. So we're going to finish this hole, yes. then we're going to do what's in the bag, and then we're going to... Uh, should we have some breakfast? Or you carry on playing? You've not decided yet. I might treat you to breakfast, guys. Yeah. Right, Ben, we found yourself in line with trees again. Yep. <laughs> Loving the trees. So this is uh, 150 metres away. Then. Yeah, Ben, this is where you find it a bit harder, isn't it? Well done. Very well done. I didn't see it down, but it was uh, just down that right-hand side. But we've just been talking about this, haven't we, Ben? How this now, this doesn't look that extreme on camera, but I believe, believe me, it's an extreme slope. But this is where you struggle most, isn't it? Yeah, pretty much just two mils under the heel. Or, you know, two mil difference under the heel makes nearly an inch difference at the top. Yes, of course. And it uh, yeah, tends to tip you backwards quite, quite easily or forwards. And I love what Ben said before. I was asking him, is there any time where you, you wouldn't hit it off a certain hill? And you said, absolutely no. No, you'd have a go. 
What's the worst can happen? You fall over and you get up and go again. I love that. I absolutely love it. And that should be a message to everyone out there. You know, the lie shouldn't have play a big factor. You just go and go and give it a go. And if it fails, just get back up and try again. Right, here we go, Jamie. Splitting the fairway, sir. Yeah, Without I'm, question, the best drive of the whole day. Unfamiliar territory for me. And this is the last hole, so what a great timing. Got 120 odd meters into this hole. Well, that well, definitely well. secures the win for you, I would believe. Well, Just well. on the front edge. Good work, sir. I'm glad I hit your driver, Ben. So if I hit it that bad, it's ended up good. Yeah, it's uh, it's in the middle. Well, you know, not far off it. Not far from the brook. <laughs> there you go. I'm changing you already. 100, and, 100 yards, 100 metres, sorry, exactly. Um, yeah, because your, with your drive, it's a very low lofty drive, so I can get a fly on it at all. We're going to talk about it in the what's in the bag shortly. So stay tuned. Right, come on. Stick it in close. Looking good. Looking even better. Yeah, lovely. Shall do. Lovely. It's about time. <laughs> now the true professional comes out. Well, I birded the first, I might bird the last. That's, so that's, that's all you need to know. Right, Ben, so we found it. I'm just taking a drop off the path. Um, come on, we want to see one get inside, inside mine. What are we going with? I've got to work out these new wedges. It's the uh, 52. Tightlist SM5. Okay, so this is new wedge for him, so it's a bit of a learning curve. Different shafts, different everywhere, everything that I'm used to, so we'll see how we go. Short. Yeah, just not quite used to these wedges just yet. Not been your strongest part of the game today. No. But it, it's a little chip on the green now. Does this guy put a foot wrong? He's just been steady Eddie. Come on Jamie, finish it off with style. Here we go. So across the green, pin's just here. Come on turn, Track. Oh, it's right on the edge. I'll take my path. You can have that sir, and you can take the victory. Well done. Here we go. That's it. You can do it. He's got it. Ooh. Well off the line. Perfect length. Well, I'd give him that one, Jamie. It's up to you. I will. No more tormenting. The way he puts in that range normally. Yes. Right, come on. All right. Rick for the bird. He's chased Ooh. it in. Oh, just missed. Give the wow. man his par. Lovely work. Right, guys, that was a huge pleasure to play with both of you today. Thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed it. Thanks very much. Good fun. Honestly, Thank I you. really enjoyed it. I'll get the camera and shake your hand at the same yeah, time. Really Honestly, Jamie, that was super. Uh, guys, do everyone. give these guys some love because they're unbelievable. Superheroes of golf. Under all the elements, they play some great golf. Um, you don't really have anything to plug, do you, Jamie? Not really, no. Apart from the shirt? Yes, Quagga. These people try, they love and they enjoy. So this is where Ben is the president of? Yes, that's correct. Uh, thanks to Ben, I'm able to enjoy golf with people that not only uh, disadvantage but cheeky as well. I like it. We'll wander off this green actually while we chat, Ben. Ben, as always, thank you very much. Appreciate it. I was nice. managing to get in contact and actually get out here and do some filming as well, which has been great. Huge pleasure. We want to thank Parkwood International for letting us come down here and do some filming as well. The uh, course has been in great condition considering the amount of rain that we had overnight and the rain we had this morning. Uh, don't forget to go and check out uh, Ben's Facebook page, the Amputee, Queensland, the Queensland Amputee, Amputee Golf, Golf Association. Association. Yes, got it. Uh, <laughs> uh, go and give that page a like, please. 
go and give Ben some love as well as Jamie. Uh, we're going to do what's in the bag now with uh, Ben just on the side of the green and you can find out what clubs he's been using. Appreciate your time, sir. Thank you. Good work. We had a ball. It was great. Thanks for watching, guys. Do subscribe, comment down below, like, show these guys some huge amounts of love uh, and we'll see you next time.